So this is 2024's planner setup, and as you, many of you know, I had to change from a mini happy planner to a classic size happy planner because they basically stopped selling them. Yes, I have wrote a very strong worded email. Let's get into it, because I originally started with a classic happy planner and then moved to a mini. Um, so I have some bits I could recycle and reuse with this one, and that's exactly what I've done. I can't stand the waste. <laughs> This cover was originally a Falifax cover, which I had in university, and you can still see the logo. And I, it was broken. The, it used to be a clip one, and it broke. And I was like, attached to it because I used it for three years in uni. I was like, I didn't want to throw it away, so it just like collected dust. And then I thought, hmm, I can reuse this. So I cut away the whole middle part where the clip was, and then I used originally used the cover that came with the Happy Planner and just threaded it in and glued it on. But once they come out with the deluxe one, I was a lot happier because I've used the deluxe cover and done that instead because Happy Planner corners, they, they come apart and it's really irritating. So with the deluxe and the Falafax, they're very together. I painted it all pastel pink because it was pink, but it wasn't the right shade of pink. I added a little bit of cow and a bow and I think it looks really cute. I then have my little dog tag, which has my address on it, just in case I ever lose my diary. And yes... This opens and it has a little chocolate frog in it. It's just the little things, isn't it? Because I don't think I've explained how I made the cover better, this is it from the back. So this was the, the deluxe cover and I threaded it into this back pocket bit. I put it to size and you can't really tell that they were ever separate. <laughs> Opening this planet is like pure satisfaction for me. So I've continued the cow theme inside. As I said, you can't tell these are two things attached together at all because I've done it very well. Congratulations to myself. But as you can see, it's Harry Potter themed, so I've got little Harry Potter memorabilia and little things in here. And then like these things, which is like the Standard Book of Spells, they actually got stuff like our NHS numbers in it and bills, what's going in and what's going out per month, just so I put when I'm writing my bills up, basically. <laughs> now, these dashboards are all from a creator on Etsy who is in the UK. Her name's Helen and her Etsy name is HRH Designs UK and she does loads of stuff for happy planners and they look gorgeous. These are actually card holders I got off Amazon and what I do is I take one Polaroid every single month of the year and they fit two in each slot and so this is a whole year in one sheet and it's so nice to look back see how much the kids are growing and stuff and this is my layout for 2024. <laughs> Another gorgeous dashboard from Helen. And on the back of this dashboard it's all like things like to do with Dylan's DLA and his autism because we get a lot of paperwork which we need to keep hold of. Now this part, I actually got these from Warner Brothers Studios, they're little postcards, but on the back are my savings challenges, which I, or I, the sticky notes because I owe them money. So that's great. Don't waste your money on happy planner pouches. The majority of the time they're made out of paper and they don't last long. I got this from the pound shop and I just inserted it in with my whole punch. And this is where I store little drawings, which I'm going to use on my week spread. And now my diary begins. My daughter, my son, these are all just drawings I did. And uh, my other daughter. <laughs> them all together so and it's yes my bookmark says bewitchy on it of course it does and it says the word today on it once again from helen so my little week spread i'm very excited for it and i'm going to continue the rest of the year with these sort of drawings because i kind of like skipped out last year it was silhouette 